Hi everyone, my name is Chris Red. I'm here out in beautiful Sandy, Oregon at Johnson RV, home of the premium pre-owned Superstore. We are the largest dealer of pre-owned RVs in the country. And this is one of uh, a representation of our product here. This is a 2014 Leisure Travel Murphy bed. We are one of 13 United States dealers that do carry Leisure Travel new. So if you want to order something, we can help you with that. But this is a pre-owned uh, piece and we do have our inventories large and wide so we we have them quite often so if you want to call please do so this is built on the mercedes-benz chassis and this is a 2014 so they've uh, taken away some options and gained some in 2014 you could get a uh, side view camera so this rv actually has a uh, side view cameras on it which you can't get in on a newer model now which is kind of nice little safety feature driving so this is built on the mercedes-benz chassis if i opened up the door here this is where you'd fill your diesel this is the side view camera on both sides so if you're traveling in the city and you click on your blinker you're definitely going to have some uh, your blind spots are going to open up so you'll be able to see bikes and things like that this rv is does have a slide here and there's a slide topper for debris like pine needles and things like that so when you're traveling when you put your slide in it'll just roll off so it's a very nice little thing to have and not all rvs have that so this uh on newer models you'll have some storage compartments here but this has the uh an electric murphy bed so you don't have to do it manually so this is uh, actually a motor behind here so there's not some storage there but we do have some storage on the other side so this is where you're gonna store your sewage hose and that's only for extra because this coach is equipped with a macerator and uh, a macerator is a very nice feature to have on an RV because it takes that you know the thing that we don't like to do which is dump our tanks it makes it a little easier so we don't really have to mess with it so let me open up that and I'll kind of show you how that works here so this is where you're gonna have your outdoor shower and all your controls for your RV. Very easy to use. You don't have to crawl under this um, RV at all. This is where you fill your propane if you're at the fuel station. And this is your dump pulling. Your macerator is the hose that's always hooked up to your black tank. So if you leave a pack of gloves in here, all you have to do is just grab this hose, hook it up into the hole and turn it on. Very simple. So walking around to the rear of this RV, a Leisure Travel is made uh, basically with um, options you can spec out your coach any way you want this one is equipped with basically every option that was offered so it has a rear ladder it does have a towing capacity of 5,000 pounds in the back here so it's very easy to do this is going to be your uh, generator hose and it does have a backup camera at the top uh, if i show you some storage here this is a great place this is you can lift this out and you can kind of access the storage from inside the coach as well but this is a perfect spot for golf clubs or any of your you know if you bring along a tent something along those lines that's a nice uh a nice storage spot a spot that's lockable um leisure travel is made with five coats of paint so it's definitely out for the weather so if you look at the paint job it looks like a a new coach because of the fact that it it has that paint this um this is going to be a propane generator and your propane generator is located here and to turn it on is very easy inside and i'll show you that in a second uh then we have a power awning here that comes out you have a little bit of plugins for your outside uh, if I open up the door, you have a nice drop down step and then you have one line storage bin here, which is pretty, pretty nice. And then this little piece just holds it up so you can get things out without something hitting you. OK, so let's take a look inside now. So we're in a 2014 Murphy bed. So step on in. Let me turn on these lights. So the lights are dimmable. So it's a very, uh, very nice feature. You don't have to have the lights on full blast. So if you look at this, it's a great U shaped dinette with a Murphy bed. When I look up in the front, these seats swivel around. This is a 2014 Mercedes-Benz. The unique thing is this is right when they came out with the, the controls on the steering wheel. So I was just in another 2014, not a leisure travel, but it didn't have the controls on the steering wheel. So to answer your phone or scroll through the screen, that's a nice little feature to have here. And then you have uh, an aftermarket Kenwood deck there uh, with Bluetooth and that's where you'll see your backup camera and so forth. So very simple and easy to use on your controls. These are Mercedes-Benz swivel seats and they do swivel around so that's a, uh, that's a nice little feature. Opening up this, nice storage bins along the top here all lined so you have some storage. Um, and then I'm going to show you your little coat closet along the side here. Now this is going to be your control system. So this is uh, you have a tankless water heater, a Girard system it looks like, and then you have solar panels on the roof. 
This is equipped with stabilizing jacks, so two stab jacks that come down that will stop this coach from rocking back and forth. The customer previous who owned this also put tank heaters. So if you're out in colder temperatures, you can turn on your fresh gray and black tank heaters and then they're lined so they won't freeze. So this coach can actually go out in colder temperatures and not have an issue. There's an inverter control here, your tank level monitoring, and then this coach only has 12 hours on the propane gen. So not a lot. This is basically pretty new feeling inside as well. So you have a great U-shaped dinette. And this is also going to be your bed area. But before I get show you the bed, I just want to show you if you're sitting here and you're, you know, eating dinner and afterwards you want to watch a movie, this is where your television will pop up. So that's nice. And you can tuck it out of the way so you don't have to have a television up if you're not a television watcher, which is kind of nice. Storage bins along the roof here. So which is, you know, these are nice and they're just push lock. So when you close them, locked. So now we got the U-shaped dinette. We're ready to go to sleep. Okay. So let me show you how this works. This pulls right out of the way. It's not too heavy. I mean, and I just tuck it out of the way here. So we'll just put it here for the time being. If I step on this little black tab and twist, that comes off. So now most of the work is done at this point. Now we're just ready to get our Murphy bed. So I remove these nice throw pillows here. Okay. Tuck them out of the way. And this is just a uh, it has some little Velcro so it doesn't slide around and I'll just pull this. A lot of times people just lay this in the front cab because they're not messing with it. And now there's just a little button here. Um, and if I touch it, the bed just is on a, you know, it has a motor and it will just come up, raise. It's a little bit slower, uh, but it's, you don't have to work. So you can leave your bed made up. You can bring some little clips and then hold everything. So. There's a window behind the bed and you can open it up for fresh air, but very simple and easy and easy to work. So I'm just gonna continue to put the bed down and then I'll go through the, the rest of the RV. So you can leave your bed made up, you can leave your pillows in the back, you can leave your bedding on there and you just raise it up and down and then you don't have to mess with it. So your bed's out of the way when you don't need it, but when you're ready to use it, down, very easy. We're gonna walk around here. I'm just gonna show you the rest and leave that made up so I don't have to put it back. We have a convection microwave grill here, okay, by Hot Point and a Dometic fridge. Battery, propane, electric, very nice. And then you have a freezer inside here. You have a very large, deep uh, stainless steel sink, Corian countertops, and this also acts as a cutting board too when you flip it around. So kind of nice little feature. A little garbage can in the back, two burner stove. Okay, more storage along here. This is just a light. And then you have some cabinets below. So now we're gonna step into the back. The Murphy bed, the nice thing about it is you have a large shower and a place to get ready. So right here, we're looking at, I'm six foot tall. This is the shower. I'm gonna stand in here to show you how much room I have. But getting, you know, being in a, an RV shower and having move, room to move your elbows is a nice feature. Then you have your toilet, sink, and a lot of storage. Like this is for your clothes. So you have a hanging closet two drawers down down below as well. And then this is that uh, little storage compartment I was telling you that you can remove this piece and get into whatever you stored outside. So that's a nice feature. So my name is Chris Fred and I work at Johnson RV in Sandy, Oregon. That We are in a 2014 Leisure Travel Murphy bed. Uh, I wanna thank you very much for taking the time to watch my video. And if you have any questions, please call me. Thanks again.